Hello and welcome back to our ES6 introduction on free code camp. This is use destructuring assignment to pass an object as a function's parameters. In some cases you can destructure the object in a function argument itself. Consider the code below. We have const profile update which takes profile data so we pass that in there and then what it does is uses destructuring to create a name, age, nationality, and location variable with uh, from the profile data object. So we pass in an object, it would destructure it and create variables from uh, the keys within there that have the name, name, age, nationality, and location. So this effectively destructures the object sent into the function. This can also be done in place. So here we have const profile update and it's assigned, uh, well, we use the destructuring. So we're going to pass something in here and whatever we pass into this function, we want to destructure it into these uh, uh, four variables and then we can do something with it within our function. So as opposed to here where we destructured within the function, we can save time and have it nice and neat all in uh, all within our argument and that can then be used this removes extra lines and makes our code look neat this is the added benefit of not having to manipulate an entire object in a function only the fields that are needed are copied inside the function so use destructuring assignment within the argument to the function half to send only max and min inside the function. So what are they talking about? Well if we look here we have this const which is an object stats. We just want max and min so how can we do that? Right now it says change code below this line if we look at this we have const half and it's assigned uh, it gets passed in stats and then what to do with stats it takes stats max and stats min and then divides by two okay so what we want to do is instead of using uh, stats passed in as an object what we want to do is um, we are going to use destructuring here to grab max and min so it should create two variables um, max and min and here we won't have to do stats.max because it should grab um, it should create our variables for us and then allow us to use them within the function and then divide by two And then this is a comment, we can just erase that. So when we do console.log stats, it should uh, be an object, it should be this object here. But when we call our half function and pass in stats, the object, it should do max. Well, it should create variable max and min uh, using destructuring and then allow us to use max and min within our function and then divide by two. So it should be 28.015 if I zoom out. We are getting that here. So it is returning the object, which is here and then it's also logging the correct answer. So let's run test. We did pass. So we're, what we learned here is passing an object as a function's parameter. We learned how to use destructuring. Um, the destructuring assignment to pass an object as a function's parameter. So we were allowed to call our function pass in an object, and then utilize destructuring 
to create variables that we want from that object and use them within our function. So long as you guys are understanding that, you're getting this lesson, and I'll see you in the next one.